Fox 46 is Matt Grant, who is live outside of Cane Creek Park. That's in Union County, where the attack took place over the weekend, Matt. Yeah, the attack happened right behind me on Saturday. The family has now started an online fundraiser to try to raise money for mounting medical bills, which are expected to be around $25,000. Tonight, the victim's brother is speaking out exclusively to Fox 46. We should warn, though, that the video you're about to see may be troubling to watch. It's okay. This carriage ride turning to chaos. A bystander uploading this video to YouTube, showing a dog attacking a horse. It happened the day before Easter at Cane Creek Park in Union County. You can hear the screams of young children as the dog escapes its leash Get the dog. and lunges without warning. He jumped up and actually latched onto the horse's throat. Those on board quickly jump off. The horse, named Queen Charlotte, uses her legs to kick the canine, but the dog doesn't relent. Man, it was bad. It was, it was horrific. The victim's brother, Travis, spoke exclusively with Fox 46. He says his sister, Amanda Medlin Underwood, tried to break up the fight. She suffered multiple head wounds that had to be stapled and a broken foot that will require surgery. The horse trampled my sister four different times throughout that event. And each time she just came back, continued to fight with the dog to try to save the horse and the, the clock. He says the attack lasted around seven minutes. Queen Charlotte suffered at least 15 bite marks, but is expected to be okay. Its face was pretty mangled um, as well, uh, and its lips were, were pretty well shredded by the dog. Medlin says the dog was put down. The sheriff's office is investigating. Union County Parks requires dogs be leashed at all times. It's a very unfortunate incident for all involved. Parks and Recreation Director Jim Chaffin says he's looking into whether any policies need to change. That's something that, that myself, along with uh, management within Union County, will be looking at in, in the next week or so just to determine what we do need to do or if there's anything that, that we should do. Amanda's a very strong, strong person. She, she loves horses. I can't imagine that uh, it would keep her away from them. Carriage rides here at the park have been suspended indefinitely. The family tells me uh, they're looking to hire an attorney and are considering a civil lawsuit uh, against the owner of the dog for the mounting medical bills. We were unable to reach the dog owner for comment. Live in Union County, Mac Grant, Fox 46.